let's start with actual construction of orthogonal projections of points, lines and planes. First, we'll study the projection of simplest geometrical element as a point. So, let's start with an example. Here, a point object A is located in the first quadrant at a height of H units above HP and distance of D units in front of BP. An observer is looking at the point in the direction of the arrow. The front view will be a point A dash on BP and its top view will be A on HP obtained by projectors drawn from the given point A. So, let's draw this projection onto a paper considering the HP is rotated in the clockwise direction by 90 degrees so that it becomes coplanar with the VP. For this, draw a horizontal reference line XY. Mark a point C anywhere on line XY. From point C, mark a point A dash at a distance of H units above line XY and point A at a distance D units below line XY in line with A dash. Here, A and A dash represent the images of the object on BP and HP respectively and the line joining A A dash is the projector line and is perpendicular to the reference line XY. Now, let's see what will be the projection of a point in the third quadrant. Observe, the point object A is in the third quadrant at a height of H units below the HP and a distance of D units behind the VP. Then, the front viewpoint A will be a point A dash on VP and its top view will be a point A on HP. So friends, now we have seen the visualization of the point. Let's see its construction. We'll repeat the step of drawing a horizontal reference line XY. Then mark a point C anywhere on the line XY. From point C, mark a point A dash at a distance of H units below line XY and point A at a distance of D units above line XY. The points A and A dash represent the images of the object on BP and HP respectively. The line joining A A dash is the projector line and is perpendicular to the reference line XY. Observe its front view will be lying below XY and top view will be above XY. Now look at the screen carefully. This is a special case in which point object R is lying within the vertical plane of the projection DP and above HP. Its front view R will be coinciding with the point object itself and will be located above the reference line XY. Its top view R' dash lies on the reference line XY. Similarly, if a point say A is lying within the horizontal plane of projection in front of VP, observe its top view A dash and front view A. So friends, now you have got acquainted with the concept of projection of a point in the first and third quadrant. And in the next session, we'll continue similar discussions for lines and planes.